<clears throat> for families who have mixed statuses and families who have families still living in Mexico, it's a big advantage to be on the border, especially if your family is right across the border. In my case, um, <clears throat> you know, my my dad was deported uh, at a very young age, and um, and he went, he was deported and stayed in Juarez, and so my family, my my mom and my sister and I lived in El Paso, so going over and seeing him was easy, or it was it was easier than others other family situations where <clears throat> it's not the case. Um, um, I would say that it's been it's been really nice just to be able to go go basically to another world on the weekends, mm -hmm. um, hang out with family you probably wouldn't do otherwise you probably wouldn't see otherwise, mm -hmm. and um, just sort of build those relationships as well, and not just like sort of leave that behind mm -hmm. because a uh, part of like just someone's migration journey is that you you sacrifice a lot and a lot mm -hmm. of the times that's family. You know, then um, a lot of the times the people who, who like, especially from Latin countries, you know, family is such a big part of their culture and being close to family is something that's very important. So, um, it, just being here on the board is like, for, at least for people in my situation, is a big mm -hmm. blessing. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> I will say that people who come to live in Mexico and come to the United States every day, it's, it's, it, it's very hard. I, I for a while, um, lived in Juarez and studied here. Uh, and so having to wake up, like maybe like at four or five in the morning, just to be in class at eight, <clears throat> is something that, I mean, it was really hard and it was very, very hard on my family as well. Um, and so it, it's, it has its pros and cons, definitely. Um, but overall, I think it's it's a good thing, just especially that family aspect. But yeah, I could say like definitely, it's something different, <laughs> something that you won't see in many places, and even in different border towns because El Paso and Juarez are just so close, um, and it's a very unique, just like pairing. But yeah, I think it has it has its ups and downs. I would say there's more ups than downs, yeah. for sure. I, 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 for me, I guess yeah, that's like the minimum that I can do for my parents. Because, um, <clears throat> I mean, a lot of it, like they ended up sacrificing their education for mine, mm -hmm. their time for mine, their bodies for mine. I mean, mm -hmm. and you know, right now, the, like I, I mentioned earlier, I'm almost, I'm about to graduate in a year. And yeah, for me, that's very huge. I mean, that's something that, uh, that's always been in the back of my my, my mind and at, at times thinking like maybe I'm not going to do it or maybe I'm not going to finish but luckily pulling through I would say amongst that uh, it, and this is this isn't something that they've ever mentioned or like my mom ever mentioned but for me like being a homeowner and trying, trying to provide that for like, for like my mom you know like more stability um, she's, she's never asked me to like Oh yeah, you need to get me a house or whatnot. But that's I feel like that's something that generally I've heard from other friends and other people in my situation where they they really just want to do that for their parents. Mm -hmm. And just I'm, I'm right now like we're in the search for a home too, and mm -hmm. and so basically right now just looking for a house to buy. And it, mm -hmm. but yeah, so that that feels really great too. Like just being able to help provide a, a way for that as well. <coughs> mm -hmm. Which again, that that's nothing that's. Something that she never, after in my in the back of my mind, I was like, yeah, when I when I can, and when it's the time, like I, I do want to help provide that because, yeah, she's she's always given up so much for me and mm -hmm. has never been able to like focus on herself for like more to just be more. Yeah, I guess in a sense, she's always she's never been able to like do stuff for like herself for like the long term I guess as far as like oh yeah I'm, this is what I'm going to do like I'm going to study this and have a career in this and but no she gave it all up for mm -hmm. me and my sister so I think for me doing that the house is something that provided that stability and